Welcome to Two Minute Teacher Tech. I am Amy from Teach with Wings and we are talking about Microsoft Whiteboard today. This video will have the very basics, opening Whiteboard and drawing and erasing in Whiteboard. Other videos will have some of the other features that I'm not getting to today. To get to Whiteboard, I just go ahead and search on my computer. I just typed in white down here at the search bar and here's Microsoft Whiteboard. When it first opens on your device, it may ask you to download the app or to sign in. If it does, go ahead and do that and you will be good to go. Here it has taken me to um, an area where I have a bunch of the different whiteboards that I've used in the past, but for today I'm going to create a new whiteboard. If I want to go ahead and add people to collaborate, I can go ahead and invite someone here to collaborate and then they can write on the whiteboard with me. So you'll see down here there are various pen colors that I can just click on and use. So I can just get going right away, right on my whiteboard. Let's say I want to make that pen uh, thicker. I can always choose the different thicknesses here. And when I come back next time, it will have remembered what I used there. Now let's say I, I know that I always want a yellow pen right here. I can change the color and the next time I come back, it will be the same way. They have some really uh, neat pens that my students enjoy. This Galaxy one is kind of fun. Uh, then of course we have um, a highlighter which comes in really handy. In another video I'll, I'll show you how you can put a PDF or a Word document or other things on here and the highlighter would come in really handy if you're trying to draw attention to certain parts of the text. Uh, if you want to highlight uh, parts of speech in different color uh, and you can change your highlighters along the way. So here's a really thick highlighter. We could do something thinner and a different color. Um, so that's a really neat feature as well. Uh, you can erase, of course. As I go faster, my eraser gets bigger. I'm not sure if that's a feature of my particular computer or of Whiteboard, but you can experiment with that. And then this is a really neat draw feature. If you are a math teacher or if you are an art teacher, or if you are just someone who has trouble drawing straight lines on the board like I do. Uh, if I move, want to move this ruler around, I can just use my one finger and I can move it up, down, left, right. If I use two fingers, I can uh, pivot it. So I can draw these really great angles here. And then to get rid of the ruler, you just click on it again down here. So those are the very basics of Microsoft Whiteboard. Uh, just a great way to um, Put your ideas together, you can send it off to OneNote, uh, you can save it for the future, but Microsoft Whiteboard is a great way to collaborate and to get your whiteboard into a digital format, especially for your students who might be at home. Have a great day and I hope you'll see me again on another video.